and build the foundation for an eventual mission to Mars, which is actually going to happen very quickly. And, you know, I've always said that rich guys seem to like rockets. Go ahead. If you beat us to Mars, we'll be very happy, and you'll be even more famous. But they do like, explain that. Where's Eric? They do like rockets for some reason, huh? They like those rockets. But you know what? If, if as long as he's, it, as long as it's an American rich person, that's good, okay? <laughs> as long as he's, as long as he, as long as he's, it, as long as it's an American rich person, they can beat us. And we are making our incredible facilities, okay, available to these people that have been doing so incredibly by themselves on rocketry beyond the earth and into those forbidden skies. But they will not be forbidden for long because we are giving you a platform the likes of which nobody has ever been given before. And he opened his mouth in blasphemy against God to blaspheme his name and his tabernacle and them that dwell in heaven. And there was war in heaven. Michael and his angels fought against the dragon, and the dragon fought and his angels. And prevailed not, neither was their place found any more in heaven. And the great dragon was cast out, that old serpent called the devil and Satan, which deceiveth the whole world. He was cast out into the earth, and his angels were cast out with him. And he doeth great wonders, and maketh fire come down from heaven on the earth in the sight of men. Woe to the inhabitants of the earth and of the sea, for the devil is come down unto you. having great wrath, because he knoweth that he hath but a short time.
the future where we are a spacefaring civilization and out there among the stars this is very exciting like if you if you can't beat it join it like the purpose of Neuralink is to create a high bandwidth interface to the brain such that we can be symbiotic with AI. I try to convince people to slow down, slow down AI, to regulate AI. I met with Congress. I met with, I was at a meeting of all 50 governors and talked about just AI danger and I talked to everyone I could. No one seemed to realize where this was going. And he shall speak great words against the Most High, and shall wear out the saints of the Most High, and think to change times and laws, and they shall be given into his hand until a time, and times, and the dividing of time. This was futile. I tried for years. Nobody listened. Maybe they will. So far they haven't. One thing is for sure, we will not control it. The, the, the merge scenario with AI is the one that seems like probably the best. And he causeth all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads. I, I was really going on the warning quite, quite a lot. I was warning everyone I could. And he opened his mouth in blasphemy against God to blaspheme his name and his tabernacle and them that dwell in heaven. Now, if, if we do have a third layer, which is the AI extension of yourself, it will, it will enable anyone who wants to have superhuman cognition. And there was given unto him a mouth speaking great things and blasphemies, and power was given unto him to continue forty and two months. And if that's the case, then, and let's say billions of people do it, billions of people do it. And that no man might buy or sell save he that had the mark or the name of the beast or the number of his name. Then the outcome for humanity will be the sum of, of human will, the sum of billions of people's desire for the future. And then people may decide that they want to retain their biological self or not. I think they'll probably choose to retain their biological self. And if your biological self dies, you could just probably just upload into a new unit. Literally.